downtown Grand Rapids in the big city. Gonna try to catch some small mouths today. Looks like there's some guys trying to catch a uh, Skamania steelhead up here by the dam. I'm not here to do that today, but I'm gonna try the uh, Whopper Plopper first. If that doesn't work, I'll switch to the Helgramite. And then maybe later I'll try some Euro Tackle Micro Finesse Lures. Catch some small mouths, crappie. This is just loaded with every kind of fish, so you never know what you're gonna catch, so. Didn't wear waders or anything, because I think the water's warm enough to just, you know, go in my swimsuit, so. Let's get out there. Cast with a whopper plopper, I got a nice small mouth. Unbelievable. I mean, it wasn't even in the water two seconds. I've never um, bought one of these loon colored ones before. So it's a brand new one. Got a gift certificate for Father's Day and bought some new Whopper Plappers. And I've heard a lot of great things about the loon colored one. It's a nice smallmouth to start the day on. See if I can get them without getting myself hooked. I'm gonna have to just grab them like that. Yeah, got your lip. Ooh, is he hooked good? These hooks are crazy. There we go. Yeah. Set that down gently since they're 15 plus dollars. Ooh, what a great way to start. Thank you, sir. Ooh, one cast, one fish. These slack areas, areas obviously tend to hold fish. There's strike number four with a whopper flopper and this is a bigger fish. Looks like a smallie. I saw his outline, but not his color yet. Nice jump. Ooh, he's really pulling hard. Right against the wall here. Woohoo! What a fish. Landing him could be... Oh, and he's off! And the Whopper Plopper hit me in the head. Oh, that sucks. No, I hope I didn't lose my whopper plopper. Oh no, I didn't. Oh, that sucks. It was a big fish. Such is life. Man, I am now one for five. They keep throwing this. The hooks are amazing, but dang it, they keep jumping and throwing it. I'll keep trying though. Five strikes and 30 minutes of fishing. I'll take another one. Two strikes in a row on consecutive cast, and the second time I hooked him. Pretty sure it was the same fish. Nice smallie. So that's seven strikes so far on the loon colored whopper flopper. Ooh, he wasn't coming off, that's for sure. There's one out of the three hooks out. And two out of the three. Ooh, look at those stripes. What a beautiful fish. That's a, this is the average size down here for some reason. You do catch bigger ones, but this is the average size. They're very chunky, very strong river fish. So much fun to catch. It's just so surprising. Nobody fishes down here, so. Thank you, sir. 
Seven strikes on the Whopper Plopper in about 40 minutes. That's, that's a good morning. That one struck right next to me. Is that a large, large mouth? Yeah, nice large mouth. Woohoo! Chunker. Awesome. Strike number eight on the Loon Whopper Plopper. Thank you, sir. What a crazy place to be catching fish like this, but it's awesome. Woohoo! That's one tiny issue with the Whopper Plopper. I guess you can fix this issue by changing this front hook, but it does sometimes hang up on the line. I'm going to have to read about which hook to buy. Two or three casts with the uh, Helgramite, and I already got one on. This thing is deadly. Nice fish, whatever he is. This is my ultralight with only four pound line. I love fishing with it, but when you get real big fish on, you gotta be real patient. Woohoo! Football. We step down into the water here to land this guy. I think I might put the whopper plopper away and start fishing with the Helgramite now. Gotcha. Nice chunker. Woohoo! Yeah. Not very big, but boy, did he fight hard. He knew how to use the current. And these river fish are so strong compared to lake and pond fish. Thank you, sir. Molly on the Helgramite. Ooh, they love this thing. My all-time favorite smallmouth lure. It works really well for largemouth and pike as well. It's just a really great all-around lure. Worth every penny. I'll put the link below, my Amazon affiliate link below for this particular color, which is my favorite color. Very natural looking. Thank you, sir. Fish. Fast and furious on the Helgram right now. Woo! Look at him go. In the current. got large mouth yeah nice large mouth gotcha what a what a morning thank you sir man what a leap small mouth there's another one Man, the Helgramite. I, 
I've fished down here for a long time, for many, many years, but I've never fished here with this Helgramite before, and wow, it's insane. The Whopper Plopper is fun, but obviously it just doesn't get nearly as many strikes as the Helgramite. What a blast. No boat needed, no kayak needed. Just a rod and a reel in your own two feet. Lost another one. Right on the top of the dam here. Not surprising that they're laying on the top of the dam. So a little one. One of the best things about this lure, <clears throat> I mean, you literally just cast it out and reel it back in. It works really well drifting with the current, but here it's uh, too snaggy to just let it drift into the rocks and the branches. So I have to reel it, keep it above the snags. Right on top of the dam. Woohoo! Smally. Thank you, sir. Smallmouth on here in the shallow water. Oof. This one's going to be a challenge to land in this current. Come here, buddy. I'm going to tire him out. What a blast. He's hiding in the rocks. One of the nicer fish of the day. Come here, bud. Yeah. Awesome. He's hooked through the tongue. That's it. Just a little bit through the tongue and that's it. It's going to be a challenge to get out. Thank you, sir. No problem. Oh, nice fish. There he goes. There's another one. Little one. Large mouth. Caught a lot of these of this size today that I didn't film. It's been a fantastic morning. I'm gonna have to turn back and do the long walk back to my truck here shortly before I get too far away. I had to stop and check on a homeless guy, make sure he was breathing. A bunch of other people walked by him and he definitely looked like he could be dead. So I stopped and checked him out and he was breathing deeply, just asleep on the pavement here. Didn't look very comfortable. I think he had a hospital bracelet on too. Maybe he overdosed last night, got treated and released. I think this is where I'll call it at this little spillway. Fish here for a little bit and then take off. It's a strange place to fish, that's for sure. 
a lot of trash, a lot of homeless people, and a lot of wildlife, a lot of fish, a lot of birds eating the fish. Black water to the right of the current here. Largey. Almost time to empty the racks out of my shoes and walk back. Thank you, sir. They're holding multiple fish. This one feels a little bigger than the others. Oh yeah, definitely bigger than the others. Gonna try to take me out in the current, of course. Yeah, all largemouth in this slack area over here. This one's definitely a little bit bigger. Thank you, sir. What is this? Rock bass. Thank you, sir. The one on the edge of the current here. Little smallmouth? Yeah. Man, this tunnel's creepy. It's like the tunnel in the movie Irreversible. Oof. All right. Sit down, empty my shoes out, walk back to the truck. Really beautiful place, an unusual place to fish. And it was an amazing morning, very, very, very productive. First with the Whopper Plopper, where I think I got eight strikes. Definitely bigger fish with that, and then non-stop action with the Helgramite after that, so. Thanks a lot for watching.